Howdy y'all, this is, I'm never gonna say that again, <laughs> that sounded bad, howdy, partner, that's no better, this is old country, how about that, this is old country, and today we have the North America Animal Pack announced, and what better than today to also show off what I had been working on for a little bit, for a few days now, just here and there, you know, just make sure it all looks good. And we have my American Bison Habitat Speed Build. 
Yes, uh, this is actually one of my favorite builds I've done so far. I know I've said that about a few, but I really like building North American stuff. Um, if you watch my North American uh, pack, North America pack, animal pack, uh, reveal video, going over stuff, re reacting to stuff, you'd know that I'm a big fan of the animals of where I live. And the bison are no exception. One of my favorite animals of all time. Probably top 10. I'd say for sure top 10. Yeah, the bison is just... It's up there. And this is just a really fun build. I, I really love building these Northwoods builds. Obviously, it's very Pacific Northwest. It's very, very Pacific Northwest. Um, let's go over a few things. Um, pretty basic um, staff, or I mean guest area. Uh, though it, it, it didn't, it wasn't basic to build. It, it's a very basic, um, it has a very basic look to it. Very woodlands, very, everything's made of wood, a few chain, like, pieces here. It's, you know, it's very, it's very America. It's very North America. And I think it turned out really cool. Got this little plat viewing platformer here where a bunch of guests could, you know, gather around. And take a look at the, the bison. I think it looks really good from this angle. And I think uh, the moss, the fallen trees, the rocks, uh, the bracken, everything just really blended well together on this hillside right here. And kind of stretching over to here. And, you know, a little bit over to here. And then we pretty much... I mean, you guys saw the speed build, or at least most of it. And, you know, if you wanted to skip around to different parts. We got this huge fallen tree I kind of custom made. I think that looks really cool. And yeah, um, and a pretty basic shelter. Um, you'll see in a few days my back train camel speed build that I, I actually have that done. I, I finished the back train camel and babarusa. Funny enough, before I finish this one, which is a little weird, but they'll be out. They're uh, they'll be out. I have them scheduled to be out in a few days. I think the babarusa comes out next week and the back train camel might come out on october 3rd the day before the pack releases so because i know i'm going to be covering a lot of north america animal pack stuff obviously the week it releases and i'm going to be doing some stuff you know these next 10 days i want to say it's 10 days um that uh, we're waiting for the pack so it should be it should be a real fun time uh i also have the arctic wolf coming tomorrow I am, I'm not done with it yet. I'm about halfway through it. I decided I wanted to finish this one first. I thought this one was gonna take longer because I was gonna do the Arctic Wolf one first just to get it out of the way. But I decided I wanted to finish this one. I was kind of on a groove and I just spent a few hours on it today and I finally finished it today and I think it looks really, really good. Um, not too much else to say. It's weird that they put the food there, but not wait, yeah, whatever. Um, yeah, you know, it's pretty much just a lot of the outside is just dense forest. It's a pretty uh, layered hill underneath this, as you saw in the speed build. It's a pretty layered hill, and uh, it's just I love using these North American type trees. These North American, I guess you can use them in other continents, but they just really look Pacific Northwest, and it's one of my favorite regions in uh, in the USA. It's so cool. It looks awesome. I guess you could argue that it looks Alaskan. It, parts of Alaska, too. But, man. Does this look awesome. I guess you could argue, also... Um, a big inspiration for this, actually, came from uh, Custer National Park. It looks a lot like this in Custer, South Dakota, where you can actually find American bison, believe it or not. Did they get food? What the heck? The keeper put food here... But not any- I don't understand the keepers in this game sometimes. <laughs> yeah, um, this is an instant steam workshop. There's only one little thing of water, and it's right here. It's just decoration. I actually did all this. If you look in the speed build, I actually planted and rocked everything. And actually, this is one of my favorite kind of like custom fences I've ever made. It's so basic, yet it works so well. And I'll probably be using this in the future. I'll make a blueprint of it for myself. But if you want a blueprint of it, just download this whole th the whole map and take whatever you want from it, honestly. Whatever you want to do with it, that's your choice. This is uh, it's an American bison habitat, but you know it could be anything else you want. Doesn't matter to me. 
Uh, that's gonna be it for the video, though. And this is my favorite scape, too, the mountain scape. Oh, I love this. The biome's so good. Um, yeah, I think I covered everything. I think I really did. It's a lot more... It There's a lot to it, because like I said with the African elephant enclosure, it's really big. So it's hard to figure out how to properly fill out the enclosure without it looking like you overdid it. And I think with the mountain, just like with the mountainside, or with the hillside thing I did here with all the moss, and then kind of like open with a few trees on top, I think I really did this enclosure justice for these American bison. And I, I love how it turned out. So we'll get one more view from here. And um, yeah. It's been, uh, it's been a time. Happy North America Animal Pack Day. And uh, this has been Old Country, and Old Country is the best country. Have a good night, y'all.